so what's popping youtube as you see i'm back with another video and my today's title let me give you a life update but before we get started to my life update i need y'all to like comment subscribe share my videos follow my socials you know all that you gotta get in the mix gotta get in the loop you know what i'm saying but yeah but i know y'all be like probably like bro she keeps saying she back she keeps saying you back but i'm really finna explain so really we just finna stop all this talking we finna get into the video just that simple Oh, I'm bad. I'm finna post more content. Blah, blah, blah. A lot of people been asking me, like, Kirsten, where you been? When you gonna start your YouTube back up? Like, be more consistent. Do this, do that, do that. I had the content on my camera, like, to do all of those things for y'all. Okay. So, I had the content on my camera to do all of those things for y'all. But guess what? Somebody stole my camera. You know how they stole my camera? Because they stole my car. You know where they stole my car from? My driveway. So to break down the story to y'all, like how I found out all my stuff was gone, blah blah blah. Woo -woo -woo. Just came back from school. I started work at Amazon. With Amazon, if you miss your first day of orientation, you gotta do the process all over. It already takes you like two weeks, two, three weeks before you start. So I got home from school, laid down, got back up to get back for work, to get ready for work and go outside to walk my dog and stuff. The car's gone. But, like, I didn't notice it for real. To I was, like, I just, like, I walked out the door. I got steps to go down to, to get out of my house to, like, go in my yard. I get down the steps. I'm, like, wait, something missing. Like, where's my car? Because I was really finna crank the car in reality, like, because it was cold outside. So, I'm, like, okay, I'm finna crank the car, get it started. By the time me and Smokey finish walking, we'll do we'll, It'll be warm. I ain't got to wait for it to heat up, you know, all that, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, my car gone, like, I'm like, hmm, where my car is? So, the way my yard is, like, it's like, side of the street, mailbox, driveway, side of the street of our house. Then it's a little small portion of the neighbor's house, because their yard, they don't really have no side yard. Our yard is real big. Then it's their yard, then their mailbox, then they have their side of their yard, like, their side of, of the street to where they can park their cars. So, I'm like, maybe my mom moved my car behind there or my auntie did. Because sometimes we do block each other in the driveway. But our driveway like, six deep. But we don't, like, you can put six cars in there. But we don't drive all the way down. We just end up parking at the top. Where, like, one person might go all the way down. And other people might just stay at the top. Which causes somebody who ever drove at the bottom down. And it causes them to be blocked down. So, boom. I look behind all their cars that the neighbors have. I'm like, okay, no, my shit not here. Where my shit at? I made sure I looked, I looked in the driveway about full time, like, the car not in the driveway, I thought I was hallucinating or something, like, I'm like, okay, the car not in the driveway, okay, cool, like, what's going on, so then I went over there and stood, like, by the car, and I see glass, I'm like, no, somebody stole my car, my, this is my first day at work, so really, I really wasn't even thinking about the stuff that was in my car, my car got stolen, it was the fact that I was gonna get to work, like, you know what I'm saying? I just came back from school. I'm trying to stack my bread. Like, you know what I'm saying? I have some plans and goals because, you know, this YouTube shit kind of expensive. Like, until you start getting your views and shit, like, you going out, doing all this content, putting all this money until you actually get your subscribers, get your watch hours and shit like that. I got my subscribers for right now. I'm just trying to get my watch hours up. So, I'm doing hair videos, anything that people will view, like, Sheen Hauls, like, all that stuff like that. I got Sheen Hauls coming for y'all. I got hair videos coming for y'all. Like, before my camera got something, I had raw wave content, hair dyeing, um, wig reviews. Like, I had so much content for y'all. I had Sheen clothing hauls. I had, like, eight videos to upload for y'all. But unfortunately, they got they got stolen. So I call my mom crying and da like, bro, da da da. She like call the police. We call the police. Do a police report. You know, blah blah blah. Fast forward. A couple days later, they find my car from this man driveway. The way that the person who ever stole my car, the way that they left my car, trash. Like they went through everything. Like they even threw my cold car in the back seat. They stole my crops. They stole like. Pine greens, thunder reds, mochas. Like first of all, why are you stealing my crops? Nigga, first of all, my dog Smokey was biting on them, so he got teeth marks in them. And then the charm that was in them, they was half of them was broken. So what the fuck are you stealing, bro? For real, like, let's be real. You stealing crops that cost like thirty dollars, sixty 
dollars max depending on what style you get but 30 to 60 dollars you don't got 30 to 60 dollars well i can tell because you are still a car so you obviously don't got no gas money so look boom so the guy was like he called my mom and was like hey um i found i looked you up on facebook i seen like all of your information in your car your car was left in my driveway with the door open and stuff like that with, with, with. so my mom told him to see her video of like what the car looked like you know shit like that like and he showed us to let the door open it's paper everywhere shit broke like everything i'm like no way he broke the windows like it was a whole bunch of junk going on so he couldn't get out of his driveway so he called the police department to take to the tow shop well the tow area or whatever tow truck company whatever they towed the car to some like lot or something so i'm like okay i need to go get my stuff because when i tell you literally everything was in there my panties my bras my sweats i don't really wear jeans and shit i had jeans at the crib because i was like slowly taking stuff back home so like thanksgiving i had took some stuff back home things that i really wasn't needing so everything that was in that car was literally the major things that i needed until i was leaving so like my tv or well, no i actually still have my tv at i brought my tv back because i was always watching tv from my computer anyways so like my tv my speaker all that shit i've been here brought home so basically it was in the car my panties my bras my shoes my socks my camera because i told you i was doing content like I was making videos and vlogs and junk. Um, really like my room decorations. Because I didn't want to take down my room decorations. And then like. I had company come over in like two weeks or something. like Because I went home for Thanksgiving. And then I had like a week or two of school left. So you know. I, I'm real bougie about how. When people come into my space. Like I don't like people thinking I'm dirty or messy. And shit. Not that I give a fuck about what people think. But like still I, it, it's for me it's really for me in the inside like i don't even want to walk into nobody's room and it just looks like damn you just moved in here you got no furniture like nothing like you know what i'm saying i don't judge you but then it didn't get it's like some things you shouldn't invite people over if it's like that but it's a difference if like you don't got it if you don't got it okay it's more understandable but if you got it and you just look like it's like you buy an apartment. You just bought this apartment. So I know you got the money to buy you some furniture. You shouldn't be three months in with no furniture, bruh. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's, that, was, that was like, you can buy the apartment, but you can't afford no furniture. You should stay wherever you was at and kept stacking because don't buy no apartment and you got to get an air mattress. Mm -mm, that ain't, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's what, that's what I'm getting at, basically. But, um, I'm at work just in case y'all like, what the fuck she got going on? What's behind her and shit? but um yeah so we go to the little place where they towed the car like i'm like basically i couldn't go back there because the car is not in my name it's not my thing but it's my car though you know what i'm saying like, i want to drive a bin and shit like that so it was like boom so she got pushed her. i actually had a crank so they did something that's how they started but um i'm telling her like what to get i'm like get my panties my bra my shoes you know woo -woo 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 -woo. She like, girl, there ain't that much shit in here. I'm like, what you mean? She like, it's glass everywhere, blah, 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 woo, woo, woo. I'm like, no, I'm telling her to get my camera. But I could have sworn I put my camera in my black bag. They didn't steal my Alexa. They left my Alexa. So I'm pretty sure they didn't go all the way into that black bag. But I was like, nah, I think I did put my camera in my little cubby that's in the front. Because I was finna do a video for Amazon. So she bring me back all the stuff. I'm like, this it? So, really, it's like a couple shoes. Like, most of my Jordans gone. They stole two brand. Oh, I said Thunder Rays and shit like that. They actually stole, like, I had two brand new pair of Uggs. They stole both of them pair of Uggs. I ended up, I had bought three in total. But they sold two of them because I already had to start bringing stuff back home. Like, I knew I wasn't going to wear them gray new ones. So, I already had brought them back home. But them other boots, I was still wearing. Well, I probably wore them, like, once or twice. But I probably wore one of them once and the other one twice, like. It was one was a black pair and one was a brown pair. So, yeah, I'm like, okay. So, I'm like, where my beats at? Luckily, I knew where my beats was. I'm talking about the box. So, I go, I'm looking for the box. She's like, oh, it ain't in there. Blah, blah. I'm like, I'm glad I had my beats with me because that would have been, I just had bought the beats too. Like, my car got stolen in December. I had just bought them beats, like, late August, beginning of September. You know what I'm saying? Like, you see how that is? But it's okay. I bought a new camera. I just bought a different color. They stole. I told you they stole my Crocs and shit. They stole my Uggs. You know, woo -woo -woo -woo. I didn't really have much. 
They stole some of my clothes. I'm like, bro, you must be a bum ass bitch, nigga, or whatever the fuck, it, like whatever. And it's crazy because when they stole my car, they they just had got out of another stolen car. So whoever car they stole somebody's car before they stole mine, cause they left their car in front of my driveway, and the back window was broken, the tire was flat, you know, all that shit. So I guess that car gave out on them and they took my shit. And I'm assuming my car gave out on them and then they probably went somewhere else. But he's they stole a good look of shit. And I'm like, y'all don't have no ring cameras. Like the guy who found my car, I'm like, y'all don't got no ring cameras outside your house. Like, what the fuck? You can't tell me if you've seen this person. Like, cause there's no way. They took two pairs of Uggs, Thunder Reds, Pond Greens, Mochas, Crocs, cameras, clothes. That's already offered of eight items. Then they were in shoe boxes. So all my shoes are I'm a sneakerhead, so I don't just have my shoes laying around. They in shoe boxes. So you tell me on hand they got already like off rip. Let's see, two pairs of uh, pine green smoke of thunder, five pairs of shoes in their hand walking down the street. No, somebody either had to be there to help them or they must have stole somebody else's car, put that shit in that car. They must have one of their friends pull up, like, hey look, we got this sweet little lit, y'all, you know what I'm saying? Boom, whoop, whoop, whoop. Put in their car, like, and like, y'all don't have no cameras to see how this happened. They stole hella shit. So I'm like, there's no way they're holding that shit in their hand. It'd been different. Like, okay, they just stole the camera. They got beat boxes and everything. I have my Gucci slides in there with my box, but my Gucci slides is with me, luckily. So I just, well, I've been had them for a little minute. I bought those in Puerto Rico. So it was like, yeah. But they didn't even steal my Gucci box. I'm not sure if they looked in it or if they knew that the Gucci box was in there, but. Yeah, they look like my Converse and shit. I'm pretty sure, yeah, you don't want the Converse. But they stole all my other shoes. So, yeah. That's where I've been. That's where my content went. I had raw wave content, like... Yes. I had pictures of him. Like everything that was gonna be some good shit to post but luckily i still had some for my phone i was recording for my phone and my camera because with the canons uh i have a mark g7x3 they die fast as fuck like even if you're not using it if you like charge it okay your battery full you use it for a little bit then you don't use your camera the next time you use your camera you probably use it like 20 minutes your camera gonna die like you gotta keep that shit on the charger i don't know what the fuck be going on but yeah so that's where my life been, but I bought a new camera, so we really about to be back. I got like off rip already two videos for y'all after this one. So look, we finna keep the consistency going. I transferred to school. I'm finna try to get some content on campus, you know, woo -woo -woo -woo. try to do some homeless shelter camp some homeless shelter campaigns and shit like that, volunteering videos and blogs and stuff like that. So that's where I've been. I could have been recorded from my phone, but the quality is not as good as my phone as my camera, so it's just like, eh. But we bad though. I bought a whole bunch. Of, I bought a new tripod. They broke my tripod, but I bought a new tripod. I bought a little mic. I'm doing some gym videos for y'all. Like I really, I got y'all. Just wait on it. <laughs> but that's the end of this video. So thanks for watching. I hope y'all enjoy. I hope y'all understand where I'm coming from. I hope y'all know what's going and y'all understand my situation. And keep watching, keep subscribing, keep telling your friends, keep texting me saying where your videos at. Be on my ass, like be in my grits and eggs, as that they say. <laughs> yeah, that's it. It's not a joke. But yeah, thanks for watching. I hope y'all understand. But just know I'm coming back with feeding better videos, feeding better motion. Like I'm trying to be up by YouTube this summer. Like I don't think y'all understand. I got a lot planned at Clark that I want to do. So hopefully, by the grace of God, my plans fall through. We gonna say they are. We need gonna say hopefully they gonna fall through. Like I'm just gonna keep praying. You know what I'm saying? But y'all stay blessed. Y'all be safe.